feel really <laughs> conscious right now. Okay, so flaming. Let me stop. Flaming is not as um, as fun as you might think. So we're not actually trying to like burn these weeds to a crisp. What? Uh, what's the main? This is gonna. This is gonna work. What's the main constituent of this plant right now? Carbon. Yeah. What else is in here? Water. Water. This plant is probably like 80% water. So all we're trying to do when we're flaming is vaporize enough of that water and cause enough of the cells to just burst that we kill the plant. So I'm not gonna like creme brulee this. I'm just gonna <laughs> Dying yet? Yeah. yeah. What do you think's gonna happen on this one? Not much. Would it be different if you went through at the same height as you did on this one? Like, so to more attack, you know, go right through here instead of just hitting the tips? Yes. <laughs> So it's a little flaw in my experimental design, right? Right, Something I mean... Something you guys need to think about when you Right, and in the field, you would be going through with probably an implement that has that set at a certain height. Yeah. So you would, wouldn't have to worry What's about another that? problem with, with uh, flaming something that tall? How do you get down there? Oh, you're going to be right in there with the fire. Yeah, yeah, but... You're... I mean, if, if some of that grass is a little dry... You know, catch flame in your field. <laughs> the main reason why flaming for weed controlled strip tillage, not an option because you have all this, especially if you're using cover crops, you have all this dead stuff lying where on the soil surface and catch on fire. I've got some pictures of flaming 